friend Corey. Are you ready? I'm ready. And we're going to interview him and see if he's a good person. Corey, or how many lies have you told in your life? Uh, too many to count. I see. Um, have you ever stolen anything? And I have. Yes. If you steal something, what does that make you? Thief. Right. Uh, have you ever looked at a woman with lust? Yes. Well, you know that the Lord Jesus said if you look with lust, you have committed adultery in your heart. Yep. Have you ever hated anybody? Yes. So you know, the Bible says if you hate, you have committed murder in your heart. Yep. So we've looked at four of the Ten Commandments. You told me that you was a liar, a thief, an uh, adulterer at heart, and a murderer at heart, just like me. Yep. So on Judgment Day, would you be innocent or guilty? Uh, guilty. And where does God send guilty people? Hell. Jordan, does that concern you at all? Me? Yeah. Oh, oh I get your hair. Corey, yeah. Corey, sorry. Yeah, uh, yeah. I just interviewed Jordan. Okay, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, it, it does. It does. Uh, do you know what God has done for you, Corey, so that you don't have to? Yes. Tell me. Uh, he died on the cross for us. For our and what does that mean to you? Oh, uh, well, you know, it means that, you know, he's... He, had a, a self-sacrifice to, you know, he, he shed his own blood so that, you know, our sins could be repented and that, you know, we, you know, none of us are perfect. So uh, by him doing that, we knew that, you know, if you accept him as your Christ and, and know that, you know, through all things, uh, you know, he's there and, you know, that's what your life is defined by. And, you know, you know that him dying on the cross for us is pretty much what, what keeps us, uh, you know, once you realize that you're his child and then you put your life in his hands and, you know, and you fully commit to him that you know you won't go to hell. Well, you're right. If we repent and trust in the Lord Jesus, yep. that's how we go to heaven. He, um, in a court of law, if the criminal's fine is paid, then the criminal's allowed to go free and the judge is not going to let a criminal go who wants to keep on doing it. Yep. So you, you know that. Yep. Um, but this accepting Jesus, we don't accept Jesus. Jesus accepts us. He's the perfect one. We're the criminal. We're, we're trying to get in his good graces. Yeah. Uh, how old were you when you got saved, Corey? I was 19. How old are you now? 21. So not very long ago. No, not Where were long. you when you got saved? Uh, Central Baptist Church. Oh, that's a great church. Uh, are you on there now? Yep. Uh, we appreciate you talking to us. Oh, no we're problem. still keep on looking for that good person. All right. <laughs>